richness I see remain to be Akajugo. Today I will explain the difference between Obu, Cham, and Aja sacrifices. Most of us in the Igbo, especially the newbies coming into ordinary Igbo, doesn't know that there is a huge difference between Obu, which is Cham, and Aja sacrifices. Obu, which is Cham, is an invasive method science that creates force on nature to perform a certain task which is not naturally programmed to manifest at the time of application. Thus, any manipulation of nature sure comes with a price. So I, Akajugo, will say that Ogo is an artificial intelligence, which I call AI, just like Alusi, but Ogo falls into scalar quantity, physics of motion. It has only magnitude with no direction. Ogo which is chance, works on how it was programmed for, just like an IC, integrated circuit, when programmed, it performed the task it was programmed for. Obu cannot operate on its own without being programmed. There are various kinds and types of Obu. We have the positive and the negative Obu. We also have low, medium and higher Obu. Positive Obu are the ones used in treating different kinds of illnesses and also the type used in chasing out negative forces like Uke, Akanoili, Ocho, Ajomo, Ajamosu, ETC. So, this type of obo are mostly used in saving lives. Negative obo, on the other hand, are the ones with higher side effects or repercussion. Let's take Okite for example. Ukite and other bigger charms, Ukaobu, are higher powered AI that comes with speed, mass and creates so much density in your desire and destiny. But because Obu has no direction in its motion movement, it is mostly likely to create havoc in its line of movement, that is your life. That is the reason it is said to have repercussion. But Aja on the other hand, Aja remains the best of the best. I would say Aja remains a vector quality in the spectrum of physics of motion as it has magnitude and direction. Due to the concept of magnitude and direction, the application of Aja is coordinated and organized. Hence, we mostly like not to create havoc on the motion movement. My aim of writing this article is to advise Ndiibo to stay off of and focus on Aja. Aja isn't evil. The animal livestock blood which we offer to deities energizes this spirit just the way vegetables, meats, fruits, crops energizes we humans. Everything in nature has what gives its energy. It is the energy you feed your forces that allow them to perform their individual duty or task in your life so that you can achieve your aim here on earth. Engineer your chi, engineer your agu, energize all your forces your Ndiotu, your spiritual spouse, your marinas, your elemental beings, all your forces, your ancestral deities, and they will help you achieve your aim here on earth. So, Mwibo, Chuba Aja, Makandi Iche Tulinu, Wesi, Kana Acho Aja, Kaipena Amande Mwa, Mwane Apu Oko Ogo, Ogo Adoma, Okite, Ibobo, Umo Ajo Ogo, Mwane Side Effects. All these charms, okay, they go go, do a community. Stay off such ogre and face your chi. Your chi is the best awele. Your chi will give you your best awele. If when you align with nature, your forces can pave way for you, even to your next life. I'll be stopping here for now. I still remain Nubia Akajuku. I come for total restoration of ordinary. Please, if you are watching my video for the first time and you are here to follow me, please follow me, like, share. Invites. Thank you.